What's up, people? So we're back with another Tekken 8 character reveal trailer. This time it's Steve Fox, very highly anticipated. So let's go ahead and see what he can do. That never gets old, never. All right, let's see what this boxer is capable of. Get ready for the next battle. Counter punch. New challenger. Oh. Steve I love it. Let's go. What? When it comes to who talks the most, you definitely win. <laughs> that was cool. Oh, I love the heat burst animation. Wow, so he has a, a lot of staggers. Oh. Yo, that's actually quite nice. That's actually quite nice. Yo, that is a really good reveal trailer, yo. This, because I've been seeing it all over Twitter, guys. People just ragging this character, but let's go ahead and um, slow things down and look at this again. So they, they called him the, the Counter Punching Paragon. Okay. So I know, I know I've been like different compared to everyone else. Cause I actually like this outfit here. I know some people are like, um, you know, we can't show the, the 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 British colors and all this, the British flag everywhere and all that. I'm like, that's where he's from. I mean, let him embrace where he's from. That's that's fine. I love the design. I love this outfit. Look at that. You you don't like this. Yo, this is cool. And actually, looking at looking at this here, it's like his his face looks it looks good in a lot of steals, and then in others it just looks terrible. But um, this is so far so good. I love the intro. Now the only thing I don't care too much for is the choker, but other than that, the outfit is a W. See, like right there, he looks really good. Okay, I'm not gonna spend any more time on how he looks, okay? This is this is fine by me. Okay, so this is a new move, whatever that is. It's a homing. And it looks to be high. Yeah, it, it kind of reminds me of uh, Peekaboo 2, but he doesn't need to go to Peekaboo, he just did it. Looks like it was probably plus. So down forward two. On counter hit now. Was that homie? Did it have the um No, I didn't have the effect, okay. But on counter hit it crumples him to where he gets the Gatling. Oh wow, so what was that there? What was this? A new new stance maybe so this here is like a super move <laughs> whatever that was man turns around obviously a high looks like a guard break because you guys see the uh the glass shattering here yeah that's definitely a guard breaker king is um yeah okay i wonder if that's guaranteed 
Okay, so that's the ducking forward two, the blue sparkle. It's it doesn't look like it guarantees. Yeah, that's a that's a huge nerf. Yeah, you can still move before he does anything. Okay, so this is skyscraper ducking neutral two. Oh, okay. So, oh wow. You guys see this? Look at this. This is the shoulder into a new homing attack that does that. And check out the stance right after he does the uppercut. Wait, right here. This is this a new flicker stance animation? And that's the um, tail spin and uppercut from that stance. Followed by Sonic Fang, which is a obvious heat engager. So that's um that's pretty huge. So back one two is the punish. The second hit homing now. Doesn't wall splat like it used to. Wow, so whatever this is is a completely new um strain. Forward two into that's crazy. Forward two into mayhem. Whatever all that is. Knocking all the furniture over. So this is an intro. When it comes to how many punches I can get off, I'll never lose. Hmm, why not kick? But whatever. Arang does do a lot of punches. Yeah, so this this here is actually not bad. Steve looks really good. I know I just said I wouldn't spend any more time. I'm not gonna pause it, but yeah, that's that's a good steal there. And this is a good intro. Yeah, these characters haven't known each other since the uh, Tekken 5 Dark Resurrection intro. No, it was, it was just Tekken 5. Okay, so back one. Back one is still fast, counter hit high. Yeah, everyone thought this move would be nerfed. Definitely not, it's the same. Okay, now this, this is dope. This is <laughs> this is a dope animation for his heat burst. He puts the glove in the screen, does the uh, the back sway one. Wait, so is that is that his two one? What is, what is this move he just did? Yeah, that's that's two one. So that that's a possible new Punisher, and it tail spins. So that's peekaboo forward two one, keeping this wild carry. Okay, so back two does not launch anymore, but it looks like it guarantees a Sonic Fang. That is huge. That is. That is crazy huge, cause um, that means if if he's already in heat, then that means that's gonna be just a straight up like big damage launcher. So let's go back here. Yeah, whiffing against Steve is um, it's been a thing you could get away with a lot in previous games, but in this game it doesn't look like you'll be able to, cause um, yeah, this this is huge. So this is his heat smash. Starts off with what looks like a down forward two. Goes into all of this. Wow, <laughs> they bounce super high, super far. So that's, oh my goodness, man. That, that is such a dope animation. Whatever he just did there. Homing on counter hit. Or was that regular hit? I don't know. And so what was that? Was that rocket launcher? I don't know what that move was. I don't know what that move is. It's a heat engager, obviously, but just a new move. Can't really tell what the um, notation is. Oh, wow. So this here is, is apparently his... Um, personality trait while in heat that gets enhanced so he does the ducking has cool sparks behind it and this is the blue sparkle looks like it comes out 
does it come out faster let me um put this back at normal speed for a second wait that was that was a little bit too fast hold up oh wow it does it instantly okay that's what i didn't catch so this is an instant blue sparkle that's why they took away the unblockables from it okay okay because you could just do this in heat and initiate the guard crush okay okay but from that now he has a a clinch tracks both directions looks like a two break you guess wrong you get uppercut it oh my goodness charge it up and send you away wow <laughs> the spiral effect brutal <laughs> very brutal Okay, now this is this is really what had me like, what? Running 2 is a heat engager and heat dash counselable. Okay, so this this is definitely um really, really strong. If they keep it plus on block. It's gonna be plus on block anyway if you use a heat dash. So this looks like forward 2-2, two, two, the new flicker stance animation into the uppercut that tail spins him. So back one and, wait, he has two flicker stances now. Okay. Yeah, I, I wonder what the name of the other stance is because look at this, back one, this is the old flicker stance. So flicker one into the albatross two. Wow, so. He has a left and right flicker, apparently. That's dope, that's really dope. I wonder what else he can do from his um, like heat stance. Like what else gets enhanced besides the ducking, like the instant blue sparkle. Okay, and this is rage art. Send them spiraling. <laughs> they get back up and have to wake up to all of this pain here. Left, right, and left and right. And that's a knockout. This is the most Steve has ever talked. Wow, and it's like a, is that a Rippukin wave behind Harar? <laughs> Yo, double Rippukin, look at that. <laughs> I'm just messing now. It's just good effects and good night, he says. Yeah, this is really good. So he runs. There's a, 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 a rope and turnbuckle. That is cool because he is a champion. Yeah. If you guys remember his Tekken 4 story. Yeah, he's definitely a young British boxing champion. And those are the fists of one. Yeah, I can't wait to see like the rest of his outfits and like what does his Tekken 7 outfit look like in the game. But to me, um, Steve looks good. Steve looks really good. Cause when you just look at the um, the win pose from um, like before, this this looked horrible. I mean, some people are saying it still looks horrible, but um, nah, I think. Um, Looking at it a little bit more with different lighting, like a different stage, it looks tolerable. Yeah, but Steve looks amazing, guys. Um, let me know what you guys think in the comments. I think Steve is a, uh, this is a W trailer. Mainly cause I love the, I love the drip, I love the fit. Yeah, and I don't mind him um, having, you know, British stuff all over his outfit, you know. The emblems and the flag colors I don't I don't mind it I, I don't mind it King is a wrestler he, he wears wrestling clothes yeah and he's from Mexico and this is definitely some tribal stuff so um, yeah he's a luchador I mean what's what's to be so upset about but um yeah Steve looks good I'm real interested in what his um, other flicker stance here, like this. 
So is this like for Rug where he has like a left foot forward? So Steve has a, a right foot forward flicker and a left foot forward flicker? Because it has a new like set of moves behind it. Mainly that big uppercut. <laughs> but I wonder what else does he have from that stance. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure he did it in this trailer here. But um, yeah, I can't wait to see like what all Steve can do. Yeah. Obviously, he can go to ducking from it. Yeah. New string looks like a very powerful, very easy wall combo ender. So, looks like uh, you might not have to always go for the, the Gatling. But yeah, Steve looks great. I, I can't stress it enough. This is, this is good. I like the outfit. I like that he talks more. Now, the new accent is going to have to grow on me, but I'm glad he's talking more. I'm glad that... Him and Horong have an intro. Just glad of it. And they gave him new stuff that looks very, very good. So, um, can't wait. Let me know what you guys think in the comments about Steve and Tekken 8. Is this a W? Is he still ugly? You guys don't like his fit? Just let me know everything. And um, make sure to hit the like button on this video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I will be covering all the rest of the character trailers weekly as promised so um i will see you guys at the next video you have a great one peace